We're really, really almost there. Let's look at the six times tables on the chart. Six times six is 36. Here's what they look like on the numbers chart. Hmm. It's a little bit like the nines and the threes, but not quite. Let's compare it to the threes times tables. All the sixes are also on the threes. They skip one. How's that work? Well, every group of six has two groups of three in it. We can't arrange them as a square, but we can remember any multiple of six is a multiple of three and a multiple of two. So the multiples of six are the even numbers that you can divide by three. Okay, here they are, but let's zoom in on the three we didn't already cover. Six times six is 36, six times seven is 42, and six times eight is 48. Now, if you remember that six times four is 24, you can double that to know that six times eight is 48. And here's our perfect square. Six times six is 36. Six times six is what? 36. Now, six times seven equals 42. Well, maybe a story will help. Let's have dinner for six people at seven o'clock on 42nd Street. Seven times six is 42. And rhyming tables are great. Six times eight is 48. One more time. The six tables are all even numbers, but they're also multiples of three. So I can add their digits. One plus two is three. Two plus four is six. Three plus six is nine. Six times six is 36. Six times eight is 48. Six times seven is 42. Do you remember them? Six times six is 36. Six times eight is 48. Six times seven is 42. And here they all are. Time for practice. The legal stuff.